that I was completely alone. I also realized how lucky I was and what a wonderful family, wonderful friends I had, but that didn't matter. I wanted the world to swallow me up. People had been talking about Cara Delevingne and how she's supposedly having a meltdown. I mean, from controversial behavior to very disturbing photos. The model had been the talk of the town for months. However, despite how fans had been debating whether the supermodel is finally out of the industry, reports suggest that she had it worse before. And this is not the first time she was under so much scrutiny. In fact, a lot of viewers believe that the modeling industry is partly to blame for her very odd behavior. If you want to know the truth behind Kara, keep watching until the very end to find out, because I will tell you everything about it. Before we begin, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and leave a comment below saying, I have subscribed, and I will personally reply to your comment. Let us begin. Number 3. Troubled Childhood Cara Delevingne was pretty young when she realized how messy her family setup was. She revealed that growing up was very stressful and narrated all the bad things she has to deal with in her March 2022 cover story for Harper's Bazaar UK. Cara Delevingne revealed to the publication that her mother, Pandora Delevingne, struggled with drug addiction before giving birth to her and her sisters, Poppy and Chloe Delevingne. To make things worse, Pandora was also diagnosed with bipolar disorder when she was young, which made parenting a little too complex. When asked about it, the model was very candid and shared how there was a time when she was not sure if anyone in her family was even okay in the first place. Everyone has something they go through with their family. My life, I feel, was very stressful because there was quite a lot of chaos not being sure if people were okay or not. The model told Harper Bazaar during the interview. As if her family issues were not enough, Cara Delevingne started to struggle mentally when she reached high school and most fans believed that this was the result of living in a very stressful environment. It was so bad that she was left with no choice but to drop out of Bidale School in Hampshire. When she reached 17, she had to deal with her sexuality. The confusion and complexity of it all threw her on the edge, and her life went downhill from there. Cara Delevingne told the magazine that if there had been more LGBTQ positive prominent figures growing up, she would have hated herself less. She believes that growing up queer has given her so much passion and determination to make people's lives easier. But before she became brave to love herself and who she really is, Cara Delevingne had to overcome so much self-doubt and self-hate. Because of this, she was later diagnosed with acute depression and anxiety. Number 2. Unending Pressure I know most are aware of how Cara Delevingne once ruled the model industry. Well, at least until she was photographed looking all troubled and jittery and just wearing her socks. A lot of people were shocked after the images were uploaded online. But there are also viewers who blame the highly demanding model industry for the disaster. All Eyes on Cara, written by Alisa lipsky Karas, discusses how Cara used social media to promote her brand, but she also discussed the drawbacks of working in her fab sector, specifically the pressure to be skinny. But there was more behind the glam and perfect looking smile. Cara Delevingne has been very candid when it comes to her struggles with the industry's ridiculously high beauty standards and the pressure goes beyond just looking thin. I mean, we've all seen the continual scrutiny that women in the media face. Lips that are too small, lips that are too wide, boobs that are too low, a bossed nose operation, weight gain, is that cellulite? There is no getting around it no matter how hard you try. And as someone who had to endure all of this, Cara Delevingne has a warning for those who refuse to stop. It makes me so angry. If you don't want to hire me, don't hire me, she told WSJ Magazine during an interview. This is why Cara's attitude of you don't like it, don't look at it is admirable. She also shared how she isn't happy about how models like her are expected to always look picture ready. It's horrible living in a world where I'll get a call from someone saying, so and so says you are partying a lot and you are looking this way and you need to lose weight. This is because Cara Delevingne is not your typical supermodel. Unlike her peers, Cara Delevingne doesn't shy away from funny photos and fooling around. If you go over her Instagram account, you will notice that she doesn't care at her posts and would upload just any picture. In fact, for her interview with WSJ, she ordered for herself and the reporter oysters, fried chicken buns, broccoli with sausage, a pork chop, and a hanger steak because she was hungry. No strict diet whatsoever. But despite how hard she ignores the pressure, she ultimately succumbs and decides to step away from modeling. This is the best example of how even a famous model like Cara Delevingne isn't immune to the pressure to look flawless. In an interview with London's The Times newspaper, she confesses that things became so awful for her that she decided to take a break from the fashion industry. When asked what she felt, the model said, I was like fight and fight for months, just constantly on edge. It is a mental thing as well because if you hate yourself and your body and the way you look, it just gets worse and worse. Her anxiety became so severe that she developed psoriasis, which required her makeup artist to paint foundation over her breakouts. In fact, she also revealed how modeling actually made her feel very empty, saying, 
modeling just made me feel a bit hollow after a while. It didn't make me grow at all as a human being. And I kind of forgot how young I was. I felt so old. This could be because the industry pushed her to mature too quickly. She claims she couldn't resist posing naked or in sexual ways when she was younger. And that affected her in so many ways possible. And we all know it's not very positive. But Cara Delevingne showed she is different when she proudly showed off her skin condition during the Met Gala. Of course, this stunt earned her a lot of compliments and I can't emphasize how much she deserved the applause. One fan wrote, Okay, like I don't really care too much about celebrities, but Cara Delevingne leaving her psoriasis visible in her Met Gala look is so validating to me. I have been so embarrassed by the severe eczema I developed on my hands. While another said, Seeing at Cara Delevingne embrace her psoriasis at the Met Gala literally makes me so emotional. Bad girls really do have psoriasis. Number 1. The Breakdown However, despite how hard Cara Delevingne tried to stay strong, the public witnessed her at her worst, when very disturbing photos of the model made rounds on the internet. As expected, fans are worried that Cara Delevingne was spotted acting strangely on a route to Wendy's airport in Los Angeles last September. The Carnival Row star was photographed on her way to the airport in the backseat of a Chevy Suburban, her feet dangling out the window as her driver navigated LA traffic. The model who was dressed in a Britney Spears t-shirt, black joggers with green, yellow, and red stripes, yellow socks, and no shoes, reportedly arrived two hours late for her trip on Jay-Z's private plane. However, it appears that there was a change of plans as Cara Delevingne and her dog exited the plane after roughly 45 minutes. It's unclear whether she was asked to leave, but it's obvious that she was not happy about it. When she returned to the tarmac, the smoking Brit appeared restless, dropping her telephone numerous times while conversing on it. Not to mention how messy and dirty she looked and her shoes were still missing in action. The number of worried tweets that flooded that night was massive. One fan said, Will someone please check on Cara Delevingne for the love of God? Another tweeted, It's so sad. All the people who have made money on her for years, where are they? With more saying, feeling for and sending love to Cara Delevingne. This is really scary and lonely. Hollywood is such a dark place and she clearly needs a team and some people that actually care about her. Thankfully, the model recently revealed that she decided that it's time for her to get her life together and seek help before it's too late. When asked what she felt when the photos were uploaded, Cara Delevingne revealed she wasn't able to sleep for days and hasn't felt okay since then. Therapy has been vital for the London-born model as it has helped her realize that her earlier quick-fix recovery was insufficient in getting to the nitty-gritty deeper issues she was experiencing. This is the reason why she has pledged to adhere to a 12-step program, which serves as a spiritual foundation for personal rehabilitation from the ravages of alcoholism. She has been the first to say that the process will include ups and downs, acknowledging that it will be a long-term commitment that will not simply be, oh look, I was an addict and now I'm sober and that's it. Cara Delevingne also shared how she celebrated her first sober new year with her family and partner. And I think we can all agree that this is a big step to her recovery. While the road will be definitely bumpy, I know that people who love and support the model will be cheering her all the way. You guys should too. What do you think about all of this? You can let us know what you think in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed today's video, we bet you'll enjoy the others that we have for you. So don't hesitate to hit that like button and hit that subscribe button to get up to date on all our amazing videos and hit that notification bell so you never have to miss an update from our channel. There's more to the entertainment. Check out this related video to see more and I will see you in the next video.